quick dev tip. Did you know that Unreal has a debug camera that you can access when you're playing? So I'm running around as a first person in the scene. If I bring up the console with the tilde key and I type in toggle debug camera with no spaces, you'll see I enter this debug camera view. And it's cool, you can fly around, you can use E to go up, you can use Q to go down, and it's no clip. So you can go through things as well. You can turn this mode off by doing the console command again. So tilt key, toggle, debug, camera, no spaces, and turns off. So if we go back into this, there's a bunch of information on the left. A couple of interesting ones are, you can see the material. So here, if you look about halfway down that list, you can see MI, prototype, grid, top, dark. And if I come over here, you can see solid blue. If you look just above that, you can also see that it has the physical material of the surface that you're looking at. And then on top of that, there's a bunch of view modes and different things you can do with this. So if you look under the controls section at the very bottom of that list of information. So if I use F, I can freeze rendering. So you can see if I turn around now, you can use the F button again to turn it back on. We can use V to cycle through view modes. So things like unlit, wireframe, all that good stuff. We can use the B key to toggle buffer visualization. So it's kind of cool. You can see more information about your scene as you're flying through. And again, you can just use the B key to turn that off. Another interesting one that's mainly for showcasing stuff is the orbiting actor stuff. So if I come over to this cube and I click left click, and then I do shift and O, now I'm centered around that. So this is kind of cool for, I guess, showing stuff off or, or getting different angles on something to check out how it looks properly in the scene. If I do shift O, I come out of that, and then I can do the same thing on the floor, say. So click on the floor, shift O, now I'm orbiting the floor. Interestingly, this is another one of those things that's existed in Unreal for a long time. So if I go over to my 4.25 project and I play and console command, toggle debug camera, exactly the same thing exists in this project as well. I literally only just found out about this super cool thing. I think we're going to use it a bunch. It's definitely worth knowing about.